Hey, Karen Ray here with Mindset Marketing. Today, I want to talk about your love life. <laughs> your love life. And <laughs> what do I mean by that? Well, um, I really do mean I want to talk about your love life. Now, if you've been following my Mindset series, we have been talking about the Law of Attraction and how it really is our brainwave frequencies that works together with the Law of Attraction principle. And if, again, if you've been following me, we also have talked about the spiritual law. And the spiritual law and law of attraction is the same. We've also talked about Ho'oponopono. So if you have not seen that video, I encourage you to get the Mindset series. Um, I'll provide a link for that so you can, uh, can catch up. Now, your love life. And... Just in case you, um, it would make a lot more sense if you have uh, followed the series. But what I'm, what do I mean about your love life? Well, the principle here, the brainwave principle, and all of the other um, techniques and principles we have talked about, really, really does incorporate what is going on in your mindset, what is going on with your, your thought process. And the reason that Ho'oponopono, the scientific prayer, law of attraction, um, manifesting, visualizing, if you start, if you're doing your research and if you followed along, there is, there is one thread that stays the same. It is your emotional makeup. And when you first start following, for example, the Ho'oponopono method, it kind of goes against maybe it's the way you think about love, thank you, and forgiveness. But I want you to to look at it in a in a whole new way. If you're having a day where you're, it's challenges, struggles, maybe you're down, you're upset about something, just start thinking, thank you, thank you, I love you, uh, forgive me, and just those words and trying to bring up a feeling of that. And it doesn't even necessarily have to correlate with, with what you're thinking about at the time or the moment. Just put it towards anything or just even the emotion of it. And the emotion of it is really, really, really what translates your frequency out there like a prayer, like a prayer to the Creator, to the universe, to God. It is that frequency where the law of attraction works, where that that law works. You reap what you sow. The law of attraction where when you put that frequency out there, that's what is coming back to you. So pay attention to your your love thoughts, your love life, right? And when you start just putting Thank you. Thank you. Um, and this is what I really want you to, to pay attention to. When something is really bothering you, or if you're having fear, doubt, or anxiety, just start, you know, just maybe take a moment, close your eyes, say, thank you, thank you. And if, or if I found at first when I love you seemed awkward, just Thankfulness works the same way. So pay attention to your love life, your thought life, your mindset, and add some love to it. So we talked about your love life. Karen Ray, have a blessed day. Hope that helped. Go ahead and get on the Mindset Series and get access to all the resources so you too can change your life one thought at a time.